A tragic incident occurred on Saturday, July 23, at the Star and Scorpion pub on Uxbridge Road in Ealing. Wayne Phillips, a 58-year-old former Hammersmith and West London College student was stabbed in the heart and killed shortly before midnight. Phillips, who was fondly known as Shax by many, is survived by his wife and children. The entire community was deeply shocked and saddened by his death. Timothy Simon, a 59-year-old man from Englefield Road, Dalston, has been found guilty of murdering Wayne Phillips. Simon was the ex-boyfriend of Phillips' partner, and could not accept that she was with him, according to the police. He has been remanded and will appear at Isleworth Crown Court on April 5 for sentencing. On the night of the murder, Phillips and two female friends arrived at the pub to attend a birthday party. They brought presents from their car and entered the pub, greeting people at the entrance. Within minutes, Simon approached Phillips, and the two men briefly fought before Phillips collapsed, having been stabbed in the chest. Simon fled the scene but was arrested the following day on suspicion of murder. He was charged with murder on the same day. The encounter was captured on CCTV, and although Simon maintained at trial that the folding knife was not his, he could be seen initially making a stabbing motion with his right hand before extending the blade and using it to stab Phillips. Phillips' loved ones continue to struggle to come to terms with their loss almost a year after the incident. A friend, known as Yami B, paid a touching tribute to Phillips on YouTube, saying, He was my bestie and my beloved big brother, rest in peace Wayne Phillips aka Shax. It's a tragic sad loss for all of us that knew him. Never a bad word seemed to be said for his entire life. How's that for somebody's life? I pay my respects to my beloved second family from my school days. He leaves behind a beloved son. What a pleasure it must have been to, have Wayne as a father, if you get what I mean, as well as brother and son. He was so respectful and true, he never really bothered anybody. He never really spoke badly about anyone either. I wish I would have had those characteristics. This tragedy was a senseless murder that was committed due to Simon's insecurity. His actions have left Philip's loved ones devastated, and the right verdict has been reached, holding Simon accountable for taking Philip's life. Our sincere condolences and heartfelt sympathies go out to the family and loved ones of Wayne Phillips during this difficult time.